Hello, it's me again, guess. Yeah, Miss Boss. I've got another presentation, and this time it's about the possessive pronouns, and they are all in your books on page 175. Your books. It's about the possessive pronouns, and when I say your books, it's a yuli buchen, and that is a possessive, it's a besit. Okay, what should you know so far? I'm not sure if you know, but let's have a look. Possessive pronouns plus nouns is my hands are cold. My possessive pronoun, nouns, hands, my hands. You have to do your homework. Your is a possessive pronoun. Homework is a noun. He lives with his parents. His possessive pronouns, parents, is a noun. Ouders, huiswerk, handen. This tree lost all its leaves. Its is a possessive pronoun for the tree. In England, a tree is a thing, same as in Dutch. But in Dutch you say, deze boom verloor al zijn bladeren. But in English you don't know if a tree is a he or a she. So you use it. And therefore you have to say its leaves. Mr. and Mrs. Baker live in London. Their sons live in Australia. Mr. and Mrs. Baker, sign that way, rhymes with a day. So their sons live in Australia. When you have persons, um, you know it's a personal pronoun, not possessive. But with the personal pronouns, you get the same possessive pronouns. Look, I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they. The possessive pronoun plus a noun is my, your, his, her, its, are, your, and their. So my book, your book, his book, and so on. Our books, your books, and their books, plural. Then you also have possessive pronouns without nouns. So my hands are cold, mijn handen zijn koud. What about yours? Who zit het met die van jou of met de jouwe? So not your, but yours. You have to do your homework. There's a noun behind it. And then you say, and I, mine. I have to do mine. Not my homework, but mine. Because there's no noun after it. Yours, mine. He lives with his parents and she with hers. Not her, but hers, plus s. So you have plus nouns and you have without nouns. And then the my becomes mine, your, yours, his, his. It's the same. Her, hers, it's, it's, it's the same. Our, ours, your, yours, and their, theirs. Okay, let's have a look. If you can put it into sentences. Some people talk about mm, jobs all the time. Twan, can you do that one? Yeah, Twan, you. Good. Some people talk about their jobs all the time. Their, because jobs comes after it and jobs, that's a noun. And people, to a rhymes with they, so their. Next. Puk, can you do this one? Perfect. I forgot my pen. I, my. Can I use yours? Very good. I forgot my pen. Can I use yours? Nothing. No noun after yours. Next. Kirsten? Good. We wrote to John, but he didn't answer our email. We are email. Next one. Trishella. Yep, yeah. excellent. I'm meeting a friend of mine tonight. Not my friend, but a friend of mine. There's nothing after it, so mine. Perfect. And not me. That's what Dutch people sometimes say. 
I'm meeting a friend of me tonight, but it's a friend of mine. It's a possessive pronoun. So I think you understand it. No. Get off your phone and watch this again. So you have to watch my video again if you don't understand it. And don't use your mobiles while you are watching. Okay. Thanks for watching anyway. If you have any questions, then you know where to find me. And I think I'm getting better and better at this. So good luck with your exercises and hope, hope to see you soon in a meeting. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.